ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ್ವ ಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದು ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನೋ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾಬನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಶಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶಕ್ಕೆ ಪಾಸಿಂದುಭವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮುಖಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚ ಲಂಗುಂ ಲಂಘೈತಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ಬಂದೆ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈ ತುಸಿ ದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸಚ ಶ್ನ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೆ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರುಂಚೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ರೋ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ಭರ ಧ್ಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟದೋಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಭಿರಿಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ಭೀತಿಹಂ ಪುನಥಪಾಲ್ಭವದೀಪೋತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಲ್ಲವನಖಚಂದಮನೀಕ್ಷಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತಕಮಿಗಬೂಷ್ವದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರಸಾಗರಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾಕೃಷ್ಣ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭುನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭುನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾ ಬುಧಾತ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕಪಿತರು ಕಮಲಾಯುತಾಕ್ಷ ಭೀಷಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರೌ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮ ಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ಬಂದಿ ದಿಬ್ಬರೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಾಸಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟ ಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷೀತ ಬಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗ ಮದಾಪುಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶ ಜುಷ ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ ಚ ಭಕ್ಷಸಿ ಜಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತೈದೇ ಸಂಬೀತ್ ಶಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಸಂಸಾರ ಸಿಂಧು ಉತ್ತರ ನೇ ಹೃದಯ ಜದೀಶಾ 
संकर्तनमृतरसे रमते मनुश्चेत प्रेमां बुधौ विहरने यदि चित्तवीति चैतन्य छंद चरणे कुरुतागम चैतन्य छंद चरणे कुरुतागम संसार सिंधु उत्तरने हृदय यदि साद संकर्तनमृतरसे रमते मनुश्चेत प्रेमां बुधौ विहरने यदि चित्तवीति चैतन्य छंद चरणे कुरुतागम चैतन्य छंद चरणे कुरुतागम गौरिय गोष्ठीपति गौरिय गोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी रघु प्रभुपाद परमंश जगदगुरु सेठ दे to arrest the current perverted tide of this crazy world is seemingly unpleasant duty of gorya math gorya goshtipati sri sila bhakti siddhant saraswati goshami tagar pahupa paramahansa jagat guru said that to arrest the current perverted tide of this crazy world crazy society is seemingly unpleasant duty of gorya mat gorya mat is equal to chaitanya mission gorya mission is equal to chaitanya mission what do you say chaitanya mission that is exactly i can say gorya mission and one thing very important it is not the duty of bhagwan it is not the duty of supreme lord to go for preaching to open one new sampraday not that it is not the duty of bhagwan supreme lord to open one new sampraday to go for preaching then sri chaitanya mahaprabhu he is non different from bhagwan sri krishna sri krishna chaitanya mahaprabhu is non different from krishna bhagwan both of them are swayam roop bhagwan not that avatar a wrong conception avatari not avatar avatari from him all countless avatar can come av ha eh? avatar hi asankhata countless avatar can come infinity world can appear by the desire of bhagwan it is not the duty of supreme lord to go for preaching it is not the duty of supreme lord to start one new sampraday it is the duty of devotee it is the devotee of exalted devotee it is not the duty of bhagwan no it is not the duty of bhagwan it is a duty of devotee bhagwan can get it done by one exalted devotee like ramanujacharya madhacharya nimarka charjo vishnu swami even shankar 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 is also preaching wrong but not according to the desire of according to the desire of bhagwan according to the desire of bhagwan shankar bhagwan going to preach mayavad so he is also coming so this way we see it is not the duty of supreme lord is duty of all devotee point is there why then bhagwan going for preaching in preaching field why mahaprabhu took sanyas i can give answer day by day not today today topics is totally different then why mahaprabhu taking sanyas why going into for preaching why that is the that is the secret reason i can speak after chaitan mahapu already told that kika sanya se mor prem nijodhan what is the utility for me to take sanyas because prem is my own property prem is my own property it is inside me so what's the why kika sanyas e mor prem nijodhan 
Prem is my own property. What is the utility for me to take Sanna? Mahaprabhu speaking. That's why I wanted to indicate something. Anyway, so Chaitanya mission and Gauriya mission, same. All other society, all other sampradaya can shout like dog. Why you are speaking so? We are not? No, you are not. We have to think about the authenticity. You have your authenticity. You have your money power. You, are, you establish a big society. But you have your authenticity, question of authenticity. It's a question of authenticity. Who, who can go for preaching? What do you mean by mission? What is the inner meaning of mission? Mission means for, for some special purpose. One team can try to preach something or do something as a representative, as a messenger, it is written. The inner meaning. Messenger. It is written. Mission means material people can find out so many different kind of meaning. But actual meaning of mission means for some absolute object. It is our conception. For some absolute object of, you know, obje absolute object of preaching. If, if some exalted sadhu, they get together, a joint, they are trying, it's called mission. Like Srila Goswami Maharaj, Srila Banu Goswami Maharaj, they were sent to foreign country, European country, England, for preaching. And Prabhupada wrote one certificate where well, they are the missionary and uh, missionary represented, missionary head, Goswami Maharaj. Prabhupada wrote so that that government can approve them authentic from Gauriya mission. It was sent. So, mission means material people can make some other meaning, but our meaning is that for absolute purpose of preaching the teachings of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu exact way, exact way, without any addition or alteration, without even any touch, dot, comma, full stop, nothing. Whatever Gauranga Mahaprabhu told, you have to speak it. That is called missionary activities. Also, some uh, material organization can identify themselves. Like Mother Teresa, they say we are mission. But that mission is material mission. We have nothing to do with that. We have nothing to do with We are actually a you know, dedicated soul. Dedicated for what? For the purpose of preaching, for the purpose of giving the exact teachings of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu without any addition and alteration. Now, when I speak, that missionary means as a representative of some head, you will have to go. Then, see Chaitanya Mahaprabhu himself is Supreme Lord. Then why Chaitanya Mahaprabhu going? To represent whom? Question can come, now. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu himself Supreme Lord. Then whom he is going to represent whom? He himself? It is one kind of Leela. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu taking the role of a devotee and at the same time going to preach about Bhagavan Sri Krishna. But actually we know Sri Chaitanya Mahapu wanted to preach his own exalted bichar and everything. Otherwise, who is going to understand Krishna? Material man, oh, with some lady is dancing. Who can understand? Those are idiot people. Even they cannot maintain their bad purity, they can go for preaching. They cannot maintain their bed, pure purity of their bed. They are going for preaching. Who told them to for, go for preaching? Papa told? Is there any evidence? So, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu himself is Supreme Lord. 
is purposely, and Simati Radharani is there, topmost preacher who? If somebody asks me, who is the topmost missionary head of, you know, of preaching, of Krishna Bhakti, Radharani? Radharani is topmost sannyas. Radharani is topmost sannyas. Radharani is a topmost representative. Nobody, never in infinity beyond can try to compete, start competition with her. And we, in this condition, we can think, we in this material condition, we are not elevated. So we can think, Nityananda Balaram is our missionary head. Okay? Yes or not? In our opinion, as per our Siddhanta, perfect Siddhanta, we don't think we are elevated. Very humble, you know. So we think Nityananda Balaram is a missionary head. It is not the duty of Gauranga Mahaprabhu to go for preaching. Preaching responsibility is lying with, totally lying with Gauranga, Nityananda. But still Gauranga going. Still Gauranga Mahaprabhu going, there is the very secret thing why he is going. Because with Gauranga, Simhati Radharani already there. Radha Krishna Pranaya Vikriti Ladini Shakti Rasmad Ekatmanu Opi Devedam Gatau Tau Chaitanya Maksham Prakadamaduna All different slokas we know. So, it is the responsibility of Nityananda, total responsibility. Preaching field totally in the hand of Nityananda. Or oh, at all Gauranga doing, still by the inspiration of Nityananda. Well, how you say? Yes, I say perfect Siddhanta. Gauranga Mahaprabhu speaking, you are making me dancing. According to your indication, I am dancing. What do you mean? What do you mean? In Lalit Madhav, now Vidagra Madhav, there is written, Rupa Goswami was writing, when Radharani, in front of Radharani, Radharani feeling some separation, tremendous separation for Bhagavan Sri Krishna. One day, Lalita coming from some place, in front of Radharani. Lalita, from where you are coming? I am coming from that place, that bun. You have seen my Samsundar? Yes, I have seen. What he is doing? He is dancing. Dancing? He is learning dancing? Who is Guru? You are Guru. I am Guru. I am here. Radharani. Try to understand, to go deep into the philosophy. I know, I don't know. I know. You will have to be very careful. Otherwise, bar tap tap bar go away. Many people say, Maharaj, you are speaking all jewel speeches, all under the guidance of Prabhupada Bhakti Thakur. But nobody is going to accept you. I know. I know nobody can accept me. With this strong belief and with enthusiastic mustu, I am doing. Some devotee speaking, Maharaj, whatever valuable speech you give, they cannot take. Because they are so politician, they like to they like to they like to motivate public that he is Baba, he is Paramansa. No? And some devotee speaking, you must wear red cloth for preaching is good. Because I am also sannyas. Because within 100 rupees, 50 rupees already there. Who can, who can come to fight with me? Within 100 rupees, 50 rupees there. So Gurudev give me and wanted to give me indication, very clever. That I give you white base, Santu Maharaj, who not? Tito Maharaj, who not? Everybody. They say, you are taking white base, but you have to preach. I have to go for preaching. Tito Maharaj himself told, who not? Santu Goswami Maharaj, Giri Goswami Maharaj, 
Nanananda Baba, everybody told me. So, today I like to explain the difference between white base and red base. But before that, I like to clarify this point. Clarify this point, which is very important. So, Simati Radharani asking Lalita, from where you are coming? I am coming from the forest. Have you seen my heart, Krishna? Yes, I have seen. What is doing there? He is dancing. Dancing. And who is Guru? You are Guru. That means Krishna is dancing according to the indication of Radharani. Radharani gives you. You will have to go. You will have to distribute Kipa to them. Then I can love you. Otherwise, now go. No, you are, no. Go fast, you distribute Kipa to all the bonded souls. Otherwise, don't come to me. A Krishna is bound to come to Radharani. Without Radharani, Krishna cannot live. The same now, what is Krishna says, Radha. So Radharani is thinking, you will have to distribute Kipa. Otherwise, I cannot. You don't come to me. So, Simati Radharani is such a gigantic personality, absolute personality, who is, who is successful to bind to bind Krishna with iron chain. Iron chain means love chain. External because Krishna is under bondage of Radharani. Like iron chain, if I put, you cannot go anywhere. But it is more and more dangerous and heavy chain. Externally, you cannot say no rope chain, no iron chain, no golden chain, nothing, no chain is there. But the chain is there which is impossible for Krishna. Maybe Krishna is almighty, but Krishna is so weak in front of Simhati Radharani, because he is Guru. So, in our stage, we are not elevated. So, according to the desire of Prabhupada, I would say that Nithyananda Balaram is a Guru. The same thing, Gauranga Mahapur speaking, same thing, Gauranga Mahaprabhu. You are, according to your gesture, I am dancing. I am puppet on a chain. Gauranga Mahaprabhu himself told. Chaitanya Bhagavad Chaitanya, you can say. So, then what I can say? So, the preaching of Gauranga is actually controlled by Nityananda. Because preaching is not the duty of Gauranga. Preaching is the duty of Nityananda. Nityananda is Avadut Sanyasi. Abadhut. Abadhut means Gyananishto, Viraktova, Madhbhaktova, Anapikshakaha, Shalinganam, Asramam, Stakta, Charet, Abhidi Gochara. They are bound in the rules and regulations. They can wear red clothes, they can wear white clothes, they can become naked. With coping, they can speak Harikatha. Shukdev Goswami without any clothes. Shukdev Goswami even without any clothes speaking. And I can speak Harikatha with only coping, provided you can bear. I can speak, I have no fear. I don't I am not feeling any shame. But I will have to act as Acharya. That's why I cannot do. I will have to follow the rules of sannyas. Because you allow me to speak Harikatha. So I am sannyas. Hundred percent. I am sannyas. If you find any fault, you can show me, I can try to rectify. If anybody would like to complain, let them say, I can try to rectify myself. But I am sannyas. And Guru Padma also wanted to give me sannyas with this idea that I can make full of public. I can make full of public they, so that they cannot understand the purpose of your white base. Tito Maharaj also told, why you take whiteness? You were supposed to take sannyas, preach. In Bhagavat is there in Vyasa Sanayi. He told. That's when they wanted to give me indication. Guru Mahi also wanted to give me indication. Maybe you are taking so hide yourself, but you will have to preach Harikatha. So what's wrong in it? No wrong in it. Now, I like to discuss some very important point regarding the, regarding the long time this fighting going on. 
Those Radha Kunda Babaji and that Navadip Babaji is there. All is fighting. Why they are taking white bears? Why they are taking sannyas bears? Why for they get, take sannyas? Follow. Where from they are getting this card thread? I give already answer. We have no parampara. I already wrote 15, 16 years back. 15, 16 years I already wrote, but they are blind. I send one, I send on man, sent one man. Radha Kundo, I cannot speak. They are Kundo, Kundo Bashi. They are staying in Kundo. Maybe Narok Kundo, who can say? <laughs> so I, my technique is uh, speaking very clear. Today I wrote one note. Uh, in a Subham writing, I say, oh, Maharaj, you know, you write only Kundo, not Radha Kundo. And you cannot speak the name of that Acharya because then I have to speak Sri and give honor. I cannot give honor. Papa, teach me. I cannot give honor to those, de those, those demons. I cannot give honor. Let them speak. I have no tin other people. Okay? Let them speak, I have no tin room, but I cannot give honor to those demons. This is the instruction of Prabhupada, I can show you. So, I wrote today, morning time, one note, Bengali note, and English you can get it very shortly. Then I wrote, I never wrote Radha Kund. I say Kundo Nivashi, Kundo Vashi. Kundo Vashi Mahanto. I don't seek our technical term like Goryo, don't you? Kundavashi Mahanto, eh? he already, you know, gone through this book. I send one man, you go, they are fighting with Goryo Mart and hand over this book to that. Now he already gone from this material world. Our problem over, but still not over. So long as Mayavad conception is there with us. Papa repeatedly told, we cannot get any benefit in preaching. That is the same thing. In the guise of Acharya, in the guise of these red clothes, sannyasis, we all Mayavadi. Mayavadi. They are totally deviated from the track of. They are totally deviated from the track. Totally deviated from the track of Gauranga. Totally deviated from the track of Bhakti Mithra Prabhupada. I can prove mathematically. Deviated. So, this is not a question of fighting. You have to prove about your authenticity. You have to prove about your authenticity, your speech, your activities can prove that you have no authenticity. Your speech, your writing, your activities can never prove that you are authentic. Cannot prove. I know you can become very angry, but you can do nothing. You have to prove it. But now, I can go back to this issue after. Now, point is that why I started that way. That why I, why I was bound to say that Sri Chaitanya mission is equal to, not equal, identical, same, one and the same. With Chaitanya mission, why I say? How much adversity I have? So that we shouting, you know, I am speaking this way? Yes, I have confidence. That evidence I can speak. Chaitanya mission is one and the same with Gauri mission. The same thing Popa told, not only told, evidences are there. We have evidence. Not only bah, 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 dry philosophy you can speak, not that. Evidence. You can remember. Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Prabhupada is the topmost Paramahansa. Topmost. Paramhansa param paramartha patim patito dhara neketa besha jatim. He is paramhansa, topmost paramhansa. Then why would he talk red cloth and danda? Well, yes, that is a technique. That is a technique. 
if there is so many society, they are not taking any name. From 108 name of sannyas, Giri, Parvad, Aranya, they are not taking. So what wrong with me? What wrong with me? I am also sannyas. Not taking any name from 108 names. So you are also taking. You have no link with 108 names prescribed in Upanishad. While you are taking sannyas, you will have to take one name from that 108 chart. But you are not taking. So, so what wrong in it? I am also sannyas. So I have to prove that I am a sannyas, first of all. Humble way. Prove means not that with false ego, not that. Humble way. Because Tinadapi, this word, is just fitting with sannyas. You, I think you never heard this kind of thing. I think you never heard. This Tinadapi word is just appropriate for this sannyasi. Because Tinadapi, if not there, what is the utility of Tirandi sannyas? No utility. By body, speech and mind, when you are surrendered, totally finish Maya, then you are Tinadapi. And when, it is like mathematics. Like mathematics. When you are Tinadapi, then Harikatha can come. Follow. Mahaprabhu told, Tinadapi Sanichana Tarabhi Saishna, Amanina Manadino, Kirtaniya Sadhavari. The first qualification of Hari Kirtan is basic thing, what is called Tinadapi. Try to. How mathematical I am want to prove? Mathematical I am proved. Like you know mathematics, basic mathematics, you can understand. So, as per the instruction of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, if there is no Tinadabi in your life, don't go for preaching. Maybe you are red cloth, blue cloth, white cloth, whatever cloth you have. But don't go. Because people now can take best. Some of our Guru Varga, I don't like to name them. They throw the sannyas base of Prabhupada, given by Prabhupada. They took white base, which is strictly prohibited. Why? Why? Because sannyas, are you going to take Paramahansa base? Prabhupada give you sannyas. I told within 100 rupees, 50 rupees is there. But within 50 rupees, 100 rupees cannot be there. Follow. But can be there. For such exalted devotee like Bhaktivinoda Thakur, Prabhupada, or Guru Varga Sama, they are all Paramahansa. They are all Paramahansa. Siddhar Goswami is Paramahansa. Bhakti Pumapur, all Paramahansa. Paramahansa they are. They are Paramahansa. But they are taking red cloth, so many reasons, if I go on speaking, it will take a long time. So first of all, point is that, that, what do you say? Sannyas base, what is the difference between sannyas and white base? What is the basic difference between these two? Because if we cannot understand, then Chaitanya mission, Kauriya mission, because everybody is going to claim. Those Babaji's staying with Mataji's, they claim. We are the representative of Gauranga. Yes, you are the representative. Yes, right you are. Come to me. You are the number one. How dare they say like this, you know? Sahajiyas. Now, first of all, I will have to establish that Chaitanya mission and Gauriya mission is all same. How I say? I say because when Shiman Mahaprabhu, Shiman Mahaprabhu and all Guru Varga, Shiman Mahaprabhu Panchatattva, all Guru Varga, they appeared in front of, in front of our Prabhupada. While he was doing Shatakati, 100 crores Nam Jagya in Chaitanya Mahat at present. That time all Panchatattva and Guru Bhargava all appeared. Hey, what you are doing? Oh, no, I'm doing. 
Go for preaching. Preaching? How I can do? No money for a month, for nothing with this. All our responsibility. All can come behind you. All money power, manpower can come behind you. Don't worry, go for preaching. Then, then, what you can say? I can simply say, because it is approved by Gauranga, Gauranga giving instruction, go for preaching. So, Chaitanya mission means Gauri mission. What's wrong in it? Who can disprove it? When Gauranga Mahapa Panchatattva, they all told directly, that's when Prabhupada is a missionary head of Gauriya Goshipati. So what's wrong in it? Or if you say Prabhupada is a liar, it's more practical for you. You can go to hell. Anyway you are going to hell. Anyway nobody can stop you are going to hell. Anyway nobody can stop you are going to hell, I can challenge. Because you are speaking lie. With this sannyas bed, with Acharya, he is speaking lie, 100%. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is there, in the form of Chaitanya Bhagavad. I am bound to say, not to fight with them. To speak actual Siddhanta. So if they say, Prabhupada told lie, okay. Okay. Prabhupada told lie. Infinity period, you go on rolling down. What problem is? We have no objection. You are going to take your risks. You are not coming to me. You are going to uh, cheat our people. Why you are going? Okay, you can go. I have no objection. I always like to speak in front of some, in front of some limited people. Very limited. Those have some conception. I am not speaking for all. So, Chaitanya mission and Gauriya mission all the same. But your mission, not authentic. Your mission, not authentic. Your mission, not authentic, not authentic, not authentic. Because you are not going to follow Chaitanya Mahaprabhu in total. I know you are going to make some reformation, change, amendment you are making. And whenever you are going to make some amendment, then you are totally Deviated from the track. Hello. Whenever you are trying to make some amendment, whenever you are going to make some amendment, then and there you are deviated from the track of Gauranga. That's okay. You show me one single case, I can discuss about the preaching procedure of Mahaprabhu. I can give countless examples. And the purpose also I can discuss. So you can, can you show me only one example that Chaitanya Mahaprabhu wanted to some, make some compromise? Okay, okay. You can show me one example. Then why, who give you permission? Now situation is such critical, I don't know. I think it is impossible. But still with enthusiastic attitude and trying. Next to impossible. Because they are following them. They can never follow them. Of course, I also don't want that everybody follow me. No need. Limited people. At least I can keep the lamp on. Before going away from this world. I, I, in front of Gauranga, Chaitanya, I say, before I go back from this world, I can keep some lamp glowing on. I cannot allow the lamp to put off. I cannot allow. This is my mission. My mission is Guru mission. My mission is Shaitanya mission. If you like to prove negative, you show me. Thousands of Harikatha, you show me one example. Oh my, you show me. Then you can prove. Only one single example. Thousands of Harikatha. Bengali, Hindi, English, so many. You show me? Even so many Harikata are not recorded before. So many. All gone? So you want? Nobody up to now never wanted to fight with me regarding Siddhanta. They are fighting with other things. Oh, I am speaking this way. Never. Nobody. Up to now. Nobody fighting. Oh, you are expressing jealousy. They are separating. You can do it. But bonded soul is 
full of jealousy. What you can do? By watching Maharaj not going anywhere, no foreign country, nowhere, but automatically Harikatha going on. Harikatha going on, no? I said, well, I need not go to America, France, Italy, no? How I can maintain myself there? It's more practical to speak Harikatha. Oh, no? So, so I can safely say that Chaitanya mission and Sigoriya mission, one and the same. I can say this. Also, what Gauriyam are doing in the small triatai, small books, what Gauriyam are doing, Popat wrote, you can give. I am also going to print and distribute among educated people. Follow, Popat wrote. I also, I like to distribute it free of cost. Free of cost, actually, if I give, I was so long distributing, but not directly. I give to Mart, different Mart, they distribute. Because Bhaman Gosima used to say, Tittama used to say, Bhakti Valot, if you give free of cost, they can throw the book. They cannot read. At least they are, if they are going to pay five rupees, it, oh, I pay five rupees, so I have to read that book. Tittama, Bhakti Valot, if you be free of cost, they cannot read. You can throw. So now I'm thinking what to do. I don't like to take even a single price for anybody. Even those who are coming from me, South India, here, there. So no, I don't need anything. You give me one rupees, because I give first grain to that baby. So you see, he's foolish. Without paying something, is ritualistic, valueless. So I told, you give me one rupees in the afternoon. One rupees, why? He's putting in. only one rupees. You give me. One rupees, yes. Because without taking one rupees, I give first grain to the baby. Useless. His foolish cannot understand. I don't need any pranami from anybody. I give him saying, go away, go away, don't need it. <laughs> Automatically, Bhagavan sending, whatever sending I'm getting. Automatically. Because it is the mission of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. It is not my headache. My headache is there because Popat give me instruction. Otherwise, all Total headache is lying with Gauranga Nityananda. Why should I play? Oh, an ashram should be open. Oh, where from money can come? Are you foolish? It is the mission of Nityananda Gauranga. Let them do and don't do. Hey, don't do. Ah, go, go to him. I can say. I don't care. Go, no need. So, all arrangement by Nityananda Gauranga. It is their mission. About Bhagavan Sri Krishna, we know preaching is not the duty of Bhagavan. But still, time to time, we, we can see Bhagavan Sri Krishna himself appear in the form of an advisor. Not that. Advisor, giving knowledge, gyan, Bhagavad Dharma. Why not? In Gita, keeping, keeping Arjun in front, giving all lesson. Keeping Arjun in front of us, Arjun is the representative of all human, all human society, but Krishna giving all teaching. So, for whom? So, Krishna now acting as Acharya, giving, follow. I am discussing for the past two or three Kartik Bharata, same thing, you can remember. Uddhav, teachings given to Uddhav. So, it is also a, as a duty of an Acharya. Kish, Guru, na? Duty of Guru. So Krishna, when going to advise to Uddhav, he is also acting as Guru. And also in our Shastra, I can show you, Arch Archan Paddhati or other books I, you can open, I can show that Krishna Bande Jagat Guru. It is written. Krishna Bande Jagat Guru, it is written. So Krishna is the topmost Guru. At the same time, Krishna is not Guru. Because Krishna is Guru. But when Krishna is doing Rasa Leela, people can find some power, oh, what you are doing? That's why people misunderstood Krishna. All whole world misunderstood Krishna. About his Rasa Leela, this, that. So Krishna, after disappearance, thinking, I come here to show all secret thing and all so valuable thing. But all foolish people, they misunderstand me. 
They don't understand. They think I am sense. I am running for sense gratification. Are Krishna is the supreme Lord. Come on, He is decorated with all six appliances, infinity, infinity appliances. One one appliances, infinity. Oi shajjasya samagrasya vijjasya jasotha sriyo gyan vairagya shayva saro iti bhago iti ingana. So whereas Supreme Lord is decorated, come on, when Bhagavan Sri Krishna he is decorated with all six appliances, six, all six appliances, that means oi shajjo appliances topmost, infinity. Oishajyasya samagrasya, vijyasya, almighty, powerful. In infinity, infinity world, he can do, who can do everything. So much powerful. All going to depend upon Krishna. Who not? Everybody, Sankar, Brahma, Narayan, Vishnu, all. Everybody. So, Oishajyasya samagrasya, eh? Aishadya to Samangosha. Biryo. Biryo means power. Aishadya to Samangosha. Biryo to Jaso Sasriya. Jaso. Jaso means any amount of glorification you can do to glorify Krishna. But still it is very, very small. Nothing. Krishna is decorated with infinity glories. That's why Prabhupada used to, wanted to teach us. Prabhupada wanted to teach us. When Tipura Raja, king of Ripura, king of Bardhaman, king of Taka, there is written Sri, 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 so many Sri. After that, Ananta Sri Vibhushita. You know, don't know Sanskrit Bengali, so how I can speak? So our Guru Varga is decorated with infinite Sri, not one Sri, not only one Sri. Sri, 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 you can't die long distance. Prabhupada used to teach us. So our Guru Vaishnava, our Guru Varga, those who are following Prabhupada exactly, Gauriyamat, for them, I am not speaking for him, Sahaja. I am not speaking about any Mayavadi. They are decorated with infinity. They are decorated with infinity Sri. Infinity Sri. Hello. This is... Still today, after hearing thousands of Harikatha, still today you are not getting entry into Gauriyamat. Even after hearing thousands of Harikatha. Still today this, you are lacking. You are lacking something. So in a come make up, then you can get entry into Gauriyamad and discover, oh, infinity treasure. Your false ego, your vanity, eh? your jealousy, all can go into drain. Drain, you know, high drain. All stool and urine going. I put challenge. I put challenge, I have so confidence about Prabhupada. So I put challenge. All got to go to whatever amount of you know disturbance you can make, whatever criticism, whatever slag language, you go on doing. You are going to make your road cleaning. You are going to make your road clean to go to hell. So we are not going to. If any documents you can bring to me, you can say, okay, you all come. I say all of you. All over the world, all your big, big brain, they can come one side, they can put question, and I can put question, I told you, many times. But they, don't, they cannot come. And lip telecast will be there. I can put question, and they can put question. They know they have their weakness. They can never come. Many times I told them, don't fight, we have no fighting mood. We all want, like Keshav Maharaj, going to file one case against his own brother. Keshav Maharaj like to avoid looking the face of his own brother. So, why? Because Keshav Maharaj wanted to implement all the rules and regulations given by Prabhupada. Only this thing. 
Keshav Maharaj wanted to implement all the teachings given by Prabhupada. Because teaching given by Prabhupada means teaching by Gauranga Mahapu. Exact. Follow what he say. So Keshav Maharaj wanted to avoid. So Keshav Goswami Maharaj wanted to avoid watching the face of his own brother just for this one idealism. Excellent. That is, you will have to, you are bound to follow the instruction given by Prabhupada. But you are not following. You are following Sahaja track. You throw your sannyas. Why? And we are so idiot, we have no backbone. Even in front of us, all different society, they are going against Gauriya Mart, Gauriya Mission. Eh? They are going to insult Gauriya Mart. They are going to insult Prabhupada different way, not directly. Different. To ignore Gauriya Mission means to ignore Prabhupada. And those, Prabhupada Thakur speaking, they are, the, they are taking the leading, leading part. Those who are taking the leading part in their respecting mission. But they cannot prove they have their authenticity. They cannot prove that they have their authenticity. Cannot prove. So whom to follow? So the whole world is now misled. So the whole world is now misled. We are going to sacrifice our life and soul for the protection of Gaurubani, I am in the protection of Chaitanya Mahaya, I am in protection of Gauriya Siddhanta Vishara and Gauriya Mahat. We are ready. If one freedom, if one freedom fighter ready to give life for motherland, I cannot give. If for motherland, one freedom fighter can give life, I cannot give. I cannot give my life for Prabhupada and Sri Chaitanya Mahaya. Why? What do you think? What do you think about me? Gauranga Map, Prabhupada already told. Those who are not going to sacrifice their life in the, in the Sankirtan and Jagyagni, enlightened by Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, in Siva Sangan, if they are not ready, they are not member of Gauriya society. <clears throat> they are thrown away, 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 long away. By Sharup Gosai. They are thrown away and away, long away. They cannot even get the shadow of Prakito shadow. Actually, shadow is not possible. Still, in joking mood, I am speaking. Shadow is not. When, when the object is real object, try to understand. Otherwise, you can also, some days the Maharaj, your shadow is speaking. When the object is real object, real mean a Prakito object then shadow is not possible. But, like the case, Jogumaya shadow is not possible, but still possible. Jogumaya shadow possible, not possible. Jogumaya is, a, you know, a prakito sh shakti, eh? sarup shakti. Then how then Mahamaya coming? Why it is written in Brahma Sangita? Sisti Siti Palaya Sadhana Sakti Rekha Chayeva Jasya Bhavanani Vivarti Durga Ichana Rupam Opi Josho Chesta Tesa Govindu Adi Purusamba. It is written in Bhamma Samhita. What wrong in it if I speak? Sisti Siti Palaya Sadhana Sakti Rekha Chayeva. Chaya means shadow. Like shadow. So I also use it. They are thrown away and away and away. Long away. I don't know in infinity period they can come in the line of Gauriya mission or not. I think no. Because anyway they can get punishment for wrong preaching, suppression of the fact. Each and every Gauriya mat, I go and you know, I have no time. I have no time to take some prasadam. Still, like a dog, I run all mat, Gauriya mat. I request them. They are cheating you. We have one certificate from government. We are the originals, Saraswat Gauri Vaishnav Sangha. But they are not going to pay any attention. They are not. I go to Devanand everywhere. 
Now, some unknown source, unknown or known actually, but actually this black source, they are maintaining every morning. Everywhere you can go, anywhere. I am not speaking go there, not go there, everywhere, all society. All international society, everywhere go. Anywhere. There can be many international society, not one. Why they can think that I am speaking to them? They can go, all Maya. Maya, Maya. Maya. So all around Maya. I requested them, don't go there, don't do. Their plan and program is totally different. We have so countless documents. They are manipulating. They are like to suppress Gauriamad, but they don't know. They like to suppress the original Abhirbha place of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. So already I publish all. I Gaur Purnima you can publish. I already give documents. So many documents here. So this way, they are going to sh they are going to identify themselves. This way, by this kind of activities, they are simply they are going to identify themselves as a fallen bonded soul. By the activities, we have nothing to do. Slight conscious people, if consciousness is there, you can realize. You can realize. If their mission is not Chaitanya mission. Their mission is Maya mission. I told one Acharya, I told one Acharya 20, 22 years back. I told forecast 25 years back. I told the Maharaj, what you are trying, this way you are trying, huh? but all you can prove that your society is a club of Kali. Club of Kali, Kali. Like Saturday club, Sunday club. I forecast 20, 22, 25 years back. Maharaj, I know the way we like to run this mark to collect money, position, everything. But be sure, you can make one Saturday club. We have only one Saturday club in India and Sunday club one. But you can make more Sunday and Saturday club. Where all naked people dancing. Naked people. Taking some scotch and dancing with other wife, not personal wife. This is a gentleman there. At present, if I speak this kind of thing, I am uneducated, I am brute. They are gentlemen. This way I speak, no? That they can see I am brute. I am not gentleman. What to speak about sadhu? I am not sadhu. Even not gentleman. They are gentlemen. Because externally they can show, no? Very nice. They know. They are learning behavioral science. They are learning from Del Carnage. They are learning how to trick, play trick with public. I am earning money. Oh, I am guessing. This way, whole world is going to be cheated. I have nothing to do. But from today onward, I already told, whenever I can speak Harikatha, I can speak with Sanyas base. Let people come to me and fight with me. I can show. I cannot show my Paramahansa base. I am not Paramahansa. I am Sanyas. Follow this way. So now I like to discuss this point, very important point. That what is the basic difference between this red cloth, Sanyas and Paramahansa base. I can give so many examples. First of all, our Pope told that there is no difference between white base and sannyas base, I mean Paramahansa base and sannyas base in Gauriya Mat, Gauriya Mission. Because anyway we need to carry out the order of Gauranga Mahapu, I mean to run mission. The mission, I am in the mission. I am already in the mission. So if white base is there, so what? What wrong in it? I can take red bus too. But anyway, I have to carry out the order of Chaitanya mission. So I am doing it. Pope had many times told that all white base, Paramahansa base and Sanyas base in 
Gauriyamat, all the same. I can also prove, because I start at one point, you get Trinadapi. If Trinadapi is not there, Sanyas is not there. If Sanyas is not there, no Trinadapi. If no Sanyas, you cannot go for preaching. I mean, those who are with white bears, they already have Sanyas inside them. If I go on speaking about you, day by day, only on these topics, to show you what is the meaning of Paramahansa base, as a missionary, uh, you know, man, member, what is my duty? So I have done my Yukta Bhairagya. I am going to show my Radha Dasho, I mean Nitananda Dasho. So what wrong in it? If I take right? Is my Radha Dasho, I mean Nitananda Dasho. So I get red clothes. Nothing. I cannot show you Paramahansa. I can beat you. You cannot say you are Paramahansa. Why you are beating? I have my scope to beat you. Right? More practical. Now, be careful. See Chaitanya Mahaprabhu when took sannyas. What is the... It's crazy. What is the mantra of sannyas? What is the mantra of that sannyas? Etam samastayo paratmanishtha purvatanair mahadbir aham tarishwami durantaparam tamaha mukundangri nishev. This is the mantra. Secret mantra, I am not speaking, but this is written in Bhagavatam. So Mahaprabhu started glorifying this. Mahaprabhu, what is the inner meaning of sannyas? What is the inner meaning of this missionary activities? Chaitanya Mahaprabhu already wanted to prove. Nothing new. Only I want to point you out. After taking sannyas in Katwa, you don't know. Mahaprabhu started roaming around the same place. Uh, where is Vrindavan? Can you see? Oh, covered by this way. Again from there, Vrindavan Vishya, go this way. Same place, Mahaprabhu roaming around and thinking, I am going to Vrindavan. And in course of his, you know, traveling with Danda, Mahaprabhu speaking, Prabhu Kahe, Bengali you don't know, but you have to hear, Prabhu Kahe, Shadu Ei Bhikkhuk Bachan. Prabhu Kahe, Shadu Ei Bhikkhuk Bachan. Mukundo Shevan Roto Koilo Grohan. Mukundo Shevai Hoi, Sangsataran. But you don't know Bengali? What I can do? Eh? So, what Mahaprabhu speaking? Prabhu Mahaprabhu giving evidence from Bhagavatam. In Bhagavatam, that Tidandi Shanyas, you know, one man took Tidandi Shanyas like a crazy boy. Now with Danda, going to give punishment to the speech. Kai man bakka. All outside people going to spit on his body, taking away the water pot, kamundul, taking out the danda, playing with him, going to make urine on the plate when you had just started eating. But still he is not angry. Try to understand. So easily you become angry by hearing this kind of varikata. So how you can become sannyas? How? Even you cannot, uh, I take somebody there, oh, taking him, not taking me. Become angry. Why? This much you cannot be here. How you can eh, be here, become sannyasi? How? This much you cannot be here. So, Tidandi Sanya, that from Bhagavatam, some stone chip, taking stone chip, putting in the mouth. So that, if you like to speak something, but cannot speak, because stone chip is there. This way, that Tidandi Sanyas, he wanted to give punishment by body, speech and mind. Follow? And those who are Sahajiya, for them it is a red signal. For those Sahajiya Babajis, they should hear, open their ear. That Rupa Goswami already wrote, 
the indication, he already wanted to give indication that the first point, basic, is sannyas. In Upadeshamritu, oh foolish and idiot, you deserve that you are Rupanuga Bhakta, but you are not Rupanuga Bhakta. You are a fallen soul. Why you are going to fight with Gorima? Where from they getting sannyas? And I can give you answer, you come to me. I can give you answer. If I cannot give, I can throw everything and go away into forest. I can give written documents. I can give agreement with you. If I cannot prove, I can go to forest. I cannot stay with all. Rupa Goswami already written. Bacha begam manasaha. Jeevha begam. What is written? Bacha begam manasaha. Jeevha begam krodha begam udar pasta begam. So already is in six. So it is the indication. It is the indication Rupa Goswami Bhai wanted to give indication that you will have to reach Sanyas platform, renunciation, with Yukta Vairagya, balance Vairagya, all proper adjustment. That's why Paramhamsa Param Paramartha Patim Patito Dharane Kreta Vesha Jatim Jati Raja Gunai Parishabha Padam Pranamami Shada Prabhupada Padam Do you understand the meaning? He is the Paramahansa topmost. He is the Paramahansa of all Paramahansa. Wherever, whatever Paramahansa, in what Sampada may be, he is the topmost of all Paramahansa. Paramahansa Param Paramartha Padim To help us, to help us, to go advance in devotional life. He took sannyas purposely. Though he is a normal, he is a natural paramangsha. He is a natural paramangsha. Prabhupada, but still taking sannyas. By taking sannyas, he can, you know, guide us. Paramangsha varam paramartvati. Or, pati toddhara nekrita vesha jitim. Why he has taken this sannyas base? Why he has taken his sannyas base to carry out the mission? I mean Chaitanya mission. He has taken. That is the reason. Other no need. Purpose he took. Though he is naturally paramangsa. Patita dharanekita vesha. Jyoti ga, jyoti raja ga nai, jyoti raja ga nai, those were top, top yati, sannyasis, all around this world. They can bow down unto his lotus feet because he is the topmost. He is the topmost. Jati raja ganai parishyab bapadam. Big, big lecture you can give. Big, big lecture is very easy to give. Because you have appliances, no? You have appliances, no? And in Bhagavatam already it is here. Who has money power? He has everything. I am beggar. I have nothing. Who has money power? He can get control over the whole world. Because money power is there. America tried to control the whole world. China tried to control the world because money power. They don't know how much dangerous it is. So out of money power they say, hey, they are not preacher, they have not done nothing. I am the only preacher. Yes. You are going to, Maharaj, you are so foolish. You could keep silence. At least you could keep, keep silence. But now when speak out, how, ma, how great foolish you are, you are going to prove yourself. You could keep silence. At least people, eh? but now people come to know you are foolish number one. Bacha begam manasaha krodha begam jiva begam udarpasta begam etana vegana jo visa hita dhira sarmama peemam pithavim sashishyat What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean by this Upadesham Ritu Sikra? What Upadesham Ritu? Rupa Goswami was speaking He can He can make each and every man body his own disciple 
Sarvama Pithimi, Sarvama Pimam Pithimim Sashishya. He can make the whole world. He can make the whole world his disciple. Of course, provided if they want to become. So Rupa Goswami already. So for Sahajiya, you can make clip and very fast preaching. Follow. You have no controlling. You have no controlling over your speech, over your sense organ. How you can become a world worldwide preacher? World famous preacher, how? Whereas you have no controlling over your speech. Sense organ. Come on. You have no controlling over your sense organ. How you can become a eh, world class preacher? Can you prove? Can you prove? You sit. I can prove, you can prove. Give evidence from Shastra. You cannot prove. So anyway, try to distribute Harikatha, massive way. And let us hear what they are speaking. They are also going outside. Let us hear what they are speaking. We, we like to hear. I am following Prabhupada speaking. What they are speaking. Let us hear. All those un important Acharya, what they are speaking. Let us hear. They are speaking anything what Prabhupada told. I told them many times. I like to hear what you are speaking in outside. But North Muda was speaking. What North Muda was speaking? What North Muda was speaking? North Muda was speaking. Artholab, Eya, Se, Bhumiya, Pili, Deshe, Deshe. North Muda was speaking. Only money collection is my preaching mission. North Muda was wrote. I am not writing. Artholab, Eya, Se, Bhumiya, Pili, Deshe. Country to country, I can travel to collect money. So, because of money power, he can become a brick preacher? How possible? Not possible. Not possible. Because you have money power, so he can become a brick preacher? Not preacher. Because your preaching is not done in front of yourself. Bhopad many times told, you try to preach in front of yourself first. Before going in preaching field, before going and preaching field, please you try to preach in front of yourself first. When sufficient preaching done, you can get control over your sense organ, like Bacha Vegam, Manasaha, Jiva Vegam, Kudar, Udarapas, all. Then you can go for So, what Rupa Gashipad wanted to say, same like what Mahapu wanted to say from Bhagavatam, that sannyasi. He took Tira and sannyasi. I like to explain more, but time cannot permit me. You are not giving me sufficient time. Two hours is nothing. Two hours is nothing. But those idiots, they are going to misuse time, or I have nothing to do. I cannot complete. So, so actually, sannyas, Prabhupada, or our Guru Bhargava, those who are authentic Guru Bhar, they are all Paramahans. But take sannyas, why? For preaching. Because if I take white clothes, now people are useless. You can say. They are speaking like that. So we can hear one sannyasi. They are misguiding people. They are seeing the picture. You see, white bear. No, yeah. They like to compare me with other kun. They are so rascal. So idiot. There's so much adversity. Follow. Though they know that my sannyas behavior and activities are really exposed in front of public, all over the world, simply because a white cloth there. So okay, let me see what they can do. So Prabhupada told in Goryamat, they are reserved force, you know, like in military, military, you know, some can go in the battlefield and some we can keep in reserve force. So, so Guru Maharaj wanted to keep me in a reserve force. Now, in the extreme position, open. Reserve force is now open, now fight. <laughs> reserve force, Guru Maharaj open. Now I can keep you reserve force. Now reserve force open. Reserve open, go in the battlefield. So, Prabhupada used to say, they are Compensating factor of sannyas. What is wide ways 
That is sannyasi or sen. Only the difference <coughs> saffron cloth can prove that we are preacher and white cloth can prove their bhajan nishta. But preaching doesn't mean I have no bhajan nishta. Try to understand. People can misguide you. My preaching procedure, preaching interest cannot prove that I have no bhajan nishta. Or my bhajan nishta is there and if I try to do preaching, it is a contradictory, not that. It is compensating factor. It is all the way compensating factor with each other. So what is called? White base, Paramahansa base, that is red base, sannyas. So they are also not taking any name from uh, 108 list of Upanishad, sannyas. Huh? They are taking this way. Rasananda, Sarupananda, this, that. So I also get. I also not going to take natural sannyas. And somebody speaking to Sahajiya, I like to speak, a, I have to write one book on this talk, but they cannot read. They can throw the book about this difference. Somebody can say, the Sahajiya, Radha Kundal Babaji's and my Navadip, they say, well, why, why then Sanatana Goswami told why the Sanatan Goswami told Rakta Vashto Vaishnavir Paritena Jivai? A Vaishnav should not wear a, a saffron cloth. Why written? Why Sanatan Goswami speaking? I can give you an example. I have time, seven days time now. I can go on giving you an answer. But you will have to allow them to hear. You will have to force them. You will have to hear. They cannot hear. So, why Sanatan Goswami wanted to speak this way? That the red clothes of a Vaishnava need not wear, a Vaishnava Paramahansa need not wear saffron clothes. What is the meaning? What is the inner meaning? Inner meaning is that, Papa speaking or Guru Bhargav speaking, follow, a Paramahansa Vaishnava need not take saffron cloth to prove their to prove their absolute stage. <clears throat> A Paramansha Vaishnav need not accept saffron cloth and danda to prove that they are Paramansha. Need not. They can wear red cloth. They cannot wear all the same. All the same. They need not wear saffron clothes. They can or cannot. Then now I can go on explaining about the inner meaning of this word. I mean, by? By? Whom? Sanatana Goswami. And the incident happened. It is also related with preaching mission. I am not going to <coughs> break my rules and regulations. <clears throat> this is also under the category of, because those who are preaching, if you don't understand their inner Baba, their Saru Bhavakan. So it is also related with today's topics is eh, what is the inner meaning of what is Chaitanya mission? Eh, inner meaning? And uh, actually, this already I published, you know. So this way, Chaitanya, what do you mean by Chaitanya? What is the inner meaning? What do you mean by Chaitanya mission? That we need to explain. So all negative points also I'll have to explain now. If I jump, then you cannot understand because time is over. So actually point is that when Jagadananda Pandit repeatedly wanted to pray to Gaurangama, please allow me, I like to go to Vrindavan. No, 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 you cannot go. You allow me to go to Vrindavan one time in my life. No, you cannot go to Vrindavan. Why? Because Mahaprabhu knows it very well. That if Jagadananda going away from me, in the midway, he cannot reach Vrindavan, he can start crying, where is gold, where is gold? He cannot bear my separation. That's why whenever Jagadananda says, oh, I like to go to Vrindavan to have a darshan, no, I cannot allow you. 
Oh, one time I lied to you. No, I cannot allow. You are angry with me, that's why you like to go to Vrindavan. No, no, I am not angry with you. I know you are angry with me. I know you are angry with me, that's why you like to leave me and go to Vrindavan. No, you allow me to go. Then he is going to catch the lotus feet of know, Swarup Gosai. Rai Ramananda, you please. You request Prabhu not going to allow me to go to Vindava. Why not you? Then Prabhu respect you, na? Follow. Are the Prabhu, why not one time you allow Jagadana to see to see Vrindavan Mahaprabhu laughing? Mahaprabhu speaking, he cannot bear my separation. Oh well he liked to go one time in life. Okay, let him go. Let him go. Then Jagadana taking preparation how to go to Vindavan. A foolish, come to me, sit here. How to go to Vindavan? Eh? We think we can pay the plane ticket and go to Sha to Vindavan. Foolish number one. This way, Vindavan, nobody can go. He had to stay in front of Guru Vaishnava. You are so crazy, you are spending money like water for traveling here. Oh, I am traveling. Your traveling is nothing but sense gratification. Your traveling here and there is nothing but one kind of sense gratification. Nothing else. I can prove it. Where is absolute Harikatha? How you can go there? How? Living Harikatha. Where is Harikatha? There is Vrindavan. So, Mahaprabhu said, well, if you like to go to Vrindavan, okay, one time go. Then Mahaprabhu said, foolish, come to me, sit. Whenever, whenever you can go to Vrindavan, be careful. One fraction of second, one fraction of second, you should not stay without Sanatan. Follow what I say? One fraction of second, we cannot stay without Sanatan. Be careful. Always, uh, because Vrindavan is a dangerous place. You cannot understand the activities of Brajavasis. They are making chapati. They are throwing the chapati in front of me. Take it, Krishna. Yes, in front of me. I used to stay in Surya Gunda here. I am habituated. Now, if you throw me, you write, I can go away. Just you all write all over the world. I go away, I can go away. I cannot speak. I can say, I know the life. How nice. Whole day, eight hours minimum reciting Bhagavatam. Nobody there. Eight hours, continuously. And sometimes, with a broken cloth, going to Brajavasi. So take chapati. Baba, not yet ready, you come after. I go to the another house. This way, street beggar. I am habituated. Not that I can sit here, like and say, hey, you can allow me, I can go away. If you think it's very good for you, then I can go. So, Mahaprabhu speaking, let him go. After that, you see, my first instruction, without Sanatan, you cannot stay even fraction of second. All the time. Don't try to climb Giriraj Maharaj. Outside you can do parikram. Wherever you can go for darshan, parikram, anything, but under the strict guidance of Sanatan, be careful. Be careful, Jagavanna. Ah. Because Sanatan Goswai is the Acharya Sammandagan Acharya. He is a elected by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. He, he, Mahaprabhu is going to show us. He is Sammandagan Acharya. He is a Sammandagan Acharya. So we can never leave Sanatan. Follow. I can go on explaining, but time cannot approve. Time cannot give what to do. So many people waiting their new place. They can come to meet with me. So, I can explain another sloka tomorrow. This is the first sloka. I already started. Another sloka I can prove you. This whole world is unconscious. This your tilak, this your mala, this your apron, sannyas, base cannot prove that you have sufficient consciousness. Consciousness is not there. Achaitanya. Midam Bisham. I can explain this sloka tomorrow. Shamsaru Sindhu Uttarane Hidayam Yadishat 
संकर्तनामृतरसे रमते मनोचे प्रेमाबुध विहरणे यदि चित्तवी चैतन्य चंद चरणे कुरुतागम चैतन्य चंद चरणे कुरुतागम